everyone, welcome home. Today we are touring the most beautiful property in Bista. It's got five bedrooms and I cannot wait to show you. Come on in. So welcome in. This house is actually super interesting. As you know, a lot of new builds, a lot of kind of modern properties have the whole kitchen diner vibe. This actually has the dining living situation, which I really like, I think it's lovely. So like I said, we are in Bista, we are super close to Bista Village, maybe five minutes you can walk. And this is just the most incredible property. It was built around two years ago and yeah, just throughout the design is gorgeous. It's actually on Airbnb right now, I will link it down below, but the room sizes are incredible and it's just the little things like the flooring i just think this is absolutely beautiful and yeah i just think every room there's something this is definitely one to watch all the way through because i think you're going to be absolutely amazed so like i said i wasn't sure what i was going to think of the whole like living dining situation it's something my grandparents have in their house and actually was always a really nice place to hang out so i do i'm like really liking it i love what they've done with the table with the benches i think it's a really fun way to have like a lot of people in one space so it's a really fun one there is a study downstairs as well so let me show you that So super open bright hallway and into the study. This is quite a dark room right now just because the lights at the back of the house, but it's been decorated beautifully. Love the chair. It's all very kind of Vista Village vibes. You've got the Ralph Lauren home, you know, like lampshade. Love the wallpaper in here. And it's just a really good size room. I mean, I personally don't think I'd actually use this as a study. I think there's so many things that you could do with this room. But yeah, the paneling's lovely. They've carried this stunning flooring throughout. And it's just the little touches, like the radiator covers. It's the paneling and they've painted the paneling. It's just been done really nicely. So like I said, the kitchen, is separate to the dining area in this house, which is something you don't typically see in kind of newer homes, but I'm, I'm quite liking it actually. So really good size kitchen, really practical. I mean, I love a good large cutlery drawer. And then we've also got the ovens at height, which is great because I am so clumsy. If anyone else relates, I'm that person that will bend down to get something out of the oven and fully drop it and smash my beautiful pot or whatever I'm using. And then of course we've got fridge freezer. I mean, I love, I love a gloss kitchen. I've had a gloss kitchen in the past and they're actually really easy to keep clean. They look really fresh. So yeah, this is just a really lovely practical kitchen. You could potentially fit a nice little breakfast table or something in here, but yeah, I quite, I like the dining living situation. And then finally downstairs, we have a downstairs cloakroom toilet uh, with the laundry in here, which I love a good stacked laundry. This is my new thing. I don't think I'm gonna be able to have a stacked laundry in my house, but I really like how it looks. On to what is, without a doubt, my favorite room in the whole entire house. I'm not gonna make you wait till the end. I'm gonna show you right now. So like I said, it's currently on Airbnb. So a lot of the bedrooms are set up as like twin rooms or rooms for kind of kids. And this is one of them. stunning is this like I said it's the little details like look at this little hook it's got monkeys there's the little chairs with the little chest and it's just it's the textures the colors I just think it's been done so well and I think if I was like a young girl I'd have walked into this house and been like this is my room I need this room I think it's absolutely beautiful and although the other bedrooms don't disappoint this is definitely my favorite Moving across the hall, we have the family bathroom, which is a great size. And I mean, what can I say? It's a bathroom, it's a good size. It's really nicely decorated, it's super bright. But onto the more exciting things, which is the other bedrooms. So this bedroom, size-wise, is just incredible. Actually, all of the bedrooms in this house are an amazing size. Like I said, 
this one's set up as a twin as well, I guess for Airbnb purposes. But imagine this room with like a gorgeous king size bed in. You also actually have an ensuite in here, which is great. And again, a really, really good size. But I just think this room, is, there's so much you can do with this, with the shape of it. You could have a gorgeous kind of dressing table over here, looking out, doing your makeup. You've got the natural light. And then moving around, we also have built-in wardrobes. So a really nice size room. And there's five bedrooms. So the fact that like already we've seen two really good size bedrooms, I think, I think it says a lot. I think it's great. And then moving around, we have a, another double bedroom. I love the wallpaper in this one. I think this is absolutely beautiful. I'm not really like a wallpaper person, but this house is really showing me that actually wallpaper can do a lot for a property. I don't know. What do you guys think? Is it something that you have in your home or like would have? I feel like paint to me is just way easier because then I'm like, if I don't like it, I can change it. Whereas wallpaper, I guess intimidates me a bit, but definitely it's something I need to explore. Lovely size room, really lovely and bright. And yeah, just another really nice one. This property is three stories and there's two bedrooms on the top floor. They are both so spacious. There's no worries of it not feeling kind of big and airy up here. Look at this room. So this is the master and Again, probably this is my second favorite bedroom of a house. Not that I'm gonna rate every bedroom of every house we go into, but today, I think this is lovely. Again, the wallpaper. I love that when there's room in a bedroom to like exist beyond sleeping, if that makes sense. I love that there's room for like a cot in the corner and a chair in the other corner. The skylights do so much for the room. I love the hanging lights. I think they are beautiful. It's just overall a really nicely put together room with a huge mirror behind you, which is perfect for outfit pictures. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I have stood in this and taken a few pictures like three or four times, but it's fine, we don't need to talk about that. So across the hall, we then have the other bedroom, which I mean, that bedroom's larger, so I'm calling it the master, but this one has the ensuite. Again, a really, really nice room with the ensuite. It's not, I just love that other room across the hall way more than this one, but the decoration in here is beautiful. I love the prints on the wall. And of course, again, it's like another double room. The sizes are just incredible. And then the ensuite. So I just think this house offers so much space. None of the rooms feel small or pokey. Even the en suites, you feel like you have plenty of room in. There's room for a towel rail. We obviously have the shower, the toilet, the sink, everything. There's room to store your, the things you need in the bathroom. So overall, just a beautiful, airy, bright home. And it's like five minutes from Vista Village. So I mean, I'm sold and I'm not even looking for a house, but yeah, it is beautiful. Like I said, it's currently on Airbnb, so I will link that down below if you wanna have a little nosy or if you wanna book. And yeah, I mean, if you love kind of house tours or homes or you're looking to buy your first home or even you're looking to renovate a home, make sure you subscribe. We have so much more coming. If you wanna follow my own personal home renovation, that will be linked down below as along with our Instagram. I don't wanna talk about that right now. It's getting a lot. <laughs> I don't wanna get into it, but it is happening. I am sharing it if that's something that interests you. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.